Hello. Okay, let me see the comments. How are hi. you, Martina? Uh, I'm fine. I was just going to say hi, everyone. It feels yeah. like there is already so much going on. Yeah. So many people in the chat. Okay. Hi, Mocha, David, Terry, Olga, uh, Vicky, Natalie, Sonia, Mireya, Sue, <laughs> Natalie. Yeah. So good to see so many people. Hey, Sara. <laughs> hey, Olga. So, guys, Adi, hello. Before we start, um, I want to ask a favor. As usual, go and share it. You know, like take a screenshot of we doing monkey things or you know just click the share button and share it with your friends in your insta stories let people know that we are here and a special thank you to the people that is at the other side of the atlantic ocean because it's early in the morning and probably you are having breakfast with us which is also nice i mean yes. we're a nice company i think so you and i and the whole company, like me, this is <laughs> exactly. a nice company. <laughs> <laughs> we usually enjoy the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we are super excited today because we have new goodies to play with. <laughs> so I think people uh, have been asking for some time for this, like it will be so cool to have a magical mm -hmm. version of the Starbucks Squares. Here they are. Yes. Yeah, and we have been asking for, especially for some of the colors to have them in magicals. Oh yeah. I'm gonna put this. <laughs> Look at how Ooh. cool is that? Oh. <laughs> um. So yeah, we are going to show them to you today. Like we will swatch them for you to see how amazing they are because. There are some really crazy colors here that we never expect them to be like this. No, really not. Yeah. Yeah. It was like, what? <laughs> um, we also decided on like divide and conquer, like you show one set, I show the other set so we can show all the colors and their beauty, but also have some time to make a little project. With the yes, colors. exactly. We will do that. And you have to stay tuned because, of course, we will do a giveaway or maybe two. We don't know. Um, depending on how many people we have watching. Um, anything else? Oh, yeah. So, um, today for the first time, we are going live in our Facebook group, uh, Lead This Creative Gang. So, sometimes um, we cannot really see your name because you didn't allow a stranger the platform we are using to go live you didn't allow it to show your name so if you go to the um, post where i posted that we were going live in the group uh it says that you had to click in that link to just allow a stranger to show your name so we can know who you are because so far we just see facebook user exactly yeah, so I see a Facebook user in a smiley like this. And another one that said, hi, girls. But I don't know who you are in a PT. And I also see a comment from Vicky, who's saying she's new to um, Lindy's and is asking what's different with magical products. Well. These are just like regular magicals. They just that we took colors that already existed in a different format in the squirt that were a little bit thicker than a spray. Those. And those are going to be retired. Like yes. if you want them, you better go and take them from the website that, by the way, they are a special offer because they are in the retirement section. And when we run out of those, they won't exist anymore. But we will have this. <laughs> I feel like... I am so happy that we have them. Because I like them so much more in this form. Okay. Hey, Tracy, we can see you. Yeah. It worked perfectly fine. Hello. Hi, Asha. So you're here. 
Hello, Tina. Hey, Paloma. Hola, Raquel. Ay, así son many people. Hola, hey, Lila. Michelle. Poverty. Okay, so I'm going to put the intro, that intro, super cool intro that, by the way, I want to say a special thanks to my friend, our friend, Olga Hedwin, that created that fabulous intro you have seen. You will see it again because we need to switch cameras. So see you in a minute, okay? to have this long intro so we don't stress it's okay. such a relief <laughs> oh my god yes it is thank you so much olga yes i cannot pay you enough for this holy batman okay so martina which set do you want to swatch i will swatch the northern lights because it's the one that is in your screen oh okay 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 then I will go with grid not wild, white. Uh, so guys, many of you that are new to Lindis, you don't know how to open this bottle. Just take a big brush or scissors and just pull. <laughs> if you try to do it with your hand, the first time is not going to work. Yeah. So how do you pretty. have them? I will sort them as you have them in the screen. Yeah, it's so pretty. <laughs> and you, you did an amazing setup for the screens, Nunu. Thank you. Oh, my pleasure. I have fun. Okay. Yeah. Uh, oh, my God. We really need an assistant to read the comments. Like, really. <laughs> a sprinkle with cars like pan pastels um you will see that in a moment okay so we have clean water and some cards that we have already prepared like this is just in my case watercolor paper i stand with embossing ink and then added on top Lindis embossing powder, clearly clear, clearly clear. So I have this resist effect that will allow the color to flow uh, not so freely. So you will see the different rainbowish effect it has. When I spring that. Almost the same. I have just cardstock and white embossing powder okay i'm gonna get my palette ready okay so i will start with probably uh the one that has less rainbow on it that is banff blue and is inspired in the area that has this name 
in Canada. The wall, the two sets are inspired in Canada um, because the boss and Limo Weber that used to work on Lindy's and she was designing many of the colors, they took a trip to Canada and got so inspired by, you know, everything, the people, the landscapes, everything. So they made these two sets. Talking about the people, I am swatching Polite People Purple, which Ooh. I have heard that Canadians are famous for their politeness. They are super polite, super nice people. And Nunu will doing the sprinkling and the painting on two different tags. Yes. And I will be doing it on one big piece of paper. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so the first time you open them, they come with this. You keep it, okay? Just take it and put it back in the jar because this is going to absorb any humidity that can be in your powders. This band blue is an intense cobalt blue with amazing blue shimmer. Yeah, the shimmer is really amazing. Ah, yes. And the Polite People Purple, you will see it in a second, is an amazing purple with lots of, well, pink and blue rainbowish effects and an amazing golden shimmer. have too much water here. <laughs> Terry says she wants them all as usual. <laughs> we understand. <laughs> yeah, you know, we have them all and we always want more. We are a lost cause. We have actually been talking about getting bigger rings for the swatches. Yes, because I will need a hula hop. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Look, look how I have my magicals. Like I need a freaking hula hop. Yeah, it's actually a lot. <laughs> okay, so. Okay. I will keep the upper part of my tag just with these slight sprinkle effects and the base with the saturated and dissolved color. Is this blue is so intense that yeah. Oh my gosh. It's that's too much. Okay, I'm gonna place them on the side for a bit for them to dry. No my turn. Blue 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 everywhere. Um, yeah, Vicky, you have the um, link down below in the description box and you guys can use the code FRAUPONY or TENNUNEKA for a 10% off only in this set, okay? Mm, take a look at the special offers, I mean it, like the things that are in the retiring sections, uh, they are not coming back and they have really good price now. Hi, Vina. Hi, Vina. Okay, I will hide this and show it again later. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, okay. You have. Okay, so now I have, and don't freak out, okay? Poutine gold color. Poutine is a dish uh, from Canada. It's French fries with gravy and cheese, like feta cheese or goat cheese on top. It's absolutely delicious. It's one of the best things I've ever eaten in Canada. And, you know, this is just like a beautiful French fries color with gold, gold shimmer. I am using maple syrup bronze 
which I think needs no explanation. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think we all know maple syrup. I'm super addict to maple syrup. Yeah, yeah. I love uh, veggie pizza. And I take it out of the oven and then I do like that with the maple syrup. So, so you add mm. a, a little sweet dash. Yes. And, and not super sweet because actually maple is not that super sweet as could be yeah. corn syrup or other ones. But mm, I love it. Sue says she's drinking fresh raw maple syrup. How does this taste? Ooh. I have no idea. I have never heard of that. Come on, come on. You have to see this. Look how gorgeous is this gold that has some yes. pieces of green, orange, blue, brown. Oh my God, I love it. And it's, and it's actually a very nice, not too yellowish, not too yes. greenish. It's a very unique color, I think, yeah. you have there. Okay. Oops. The longer you boil it, the sweeter it gets. Okay. So it's, it's yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I think then that's yeah. why you call it syrup because it's cooked in then. Probably. A ver, usuaria de Facebook que dices, no entiendo nada de lo que decís. Lo siento en el alma. Eh, no te preocupes que cuando la semana que viene o así lleguen estos eh, Magicals a la tienda, eh, haré un directo en español, solo en español, ¿vale? Mm, tú quédate con los colores y lo bonito que quedan. Si tienes alguna pregunta en español, tú hazla que yo te contesto. No hay problema. Hey, Jess. Hi, Jess. Okay, so let's put a little bit of this beautiful gold here. Maybe. I try to lift mine a bit. Just to, sh to show how all these colors show up in these embossed little sections. I think you are right, Nunu. Showing the colors on embossed pages is really the best way because they are yeah. able to show their full beauty. I agree. I love this technique. Actually, I did all my swatches like this because it's how I use them the most. Lately. Because you are so patient. No, because <laughs> I have been kind of useless yeah. the 10 first days of the year with an injured hand and I could not work. So I was like, let's swatch the colors again. <laughs> Sue is saying a barrel of marble syrup is worth about $1,200. Wow. So wow. it's actually really gold. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, it's kind of expensive here because I don't think we can produce it in Europe. We don't have that kind of maple trees that produce the maple syrup. I don't think we can eat what we have here. Uh, so I was lucky I found it on, at Costco. I bought a one liter jar. So it okay. will last for some time. <laughs> okay, now I have O Canada Crimson, which is, oh my God, which is crazy red. I'm, I'm sorry, you know, you know, I don't like red, but this is a stunning and it has amazing gold shimmer on it, which make it super special. And I have emerald A, <laughs> <laughs> which I mean, I've never been to Canada, but I think I have been told that it is a very Canadian thing to say A, a. right? Yeah. A? <laughs> I mean, we have to trust on Tracy here with the names because she has been there with Limor. And she lives in the border, so I, I, I yes. guess she knows many, Canadian, many Canadians. <laughs> okay, let's go with the red. Ooh. 
No, not all of them have gold shimmer, Moita. 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 No, no, not all of them. No, 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 no. But I think that's a thing we can show when they are dried. Yeah. You'll see it better then. Oh! <laughs> I'm so yes. Broad my set. <laughs> Ooh, Sandra. <laughs> I mean, we, yeah, we, we, I can't say anything else, but we understand. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and Susan, I hope you enjoy on, it. Eh, as Sandra much. Winkler. <laughs> we hope you enjoy it as much as we do. Yeah. I don't think there is a single day that I don't use magicals. In my world, these days exist, but they are very rare. And, and sad. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Isa said, having lived many years in Canada, I need with cups that great white north set. <laughs> when you see them all dried, you will realize you need them all. There are some colors yeah. in that Northern Lights that are my absolutely favorites. I mean, that one special favorite is in the Northern Lights. Yes. Oh, no, both. Well, my favorites are both in... No, actually, I have three favorites. Two in Northern Lights and one in Great White North. Same as me. Come on, look at that red. It's absolutely perfect. And look at that gold shimmer. Phew. Crazy. And the green is so fresh. Yes. That crimson is amazing, right, Terry? What an amazing shade of green, said David. <laughs> He's joking. <laughs> Is he also in that? Oh no, green! No, club. no, no, he, no, no, no. He's in the green team. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now I'm going to pick one of the I will say forever favorite for everybody that was using the squirt that is Looney yeah. Tuny Teal because it's super weird. It's like a gorgeous deep teal turquoise color with purple shimmer which make it crazy. <laughs> and in the meantime, I will be using one of the other favorites. <laughs> My absolutely favorite. Mine too. Well, no, I'm not sure between these two, actually. I fell in love with Hockey Puck Black when watching them earlier today. Mm. But Canadian Bacon Blush is amazing. Where are you going? Behave. So every time I pick a new color, you see that I still have some powder here, the red. I will do like this out of camera to remove that powder. So I don't, you know, mix it. Yeah, otherwise no, you can skin. get messed up. Yeah. I actually have a wet brush by now. I need to change it. Because I wasn't careful. <laughs> I mean, this color is so amazing. It is, it is. A Facebook user, somewhere, someone in the Facebook group said, I need this, I need this set. We understand. Oh my God. Do you need to see this? I mean, there are golds and pinks and blues in this blush tone it's, it's absolutely crazy freaking amazing okay so after that we will create a small project exactly um, we will dare you <laughs> Okay, so 
do I need more? I need more. This one always freaks me out because it doesn't <coughs> seem the same color when you sprinkle it than when you paint with it. Yeah. Lindy's Banff Blue has to live up the spectacular area for which it was named and it sure doesn't disappoint. Banff Blue is a rich, deep blue with an amazing blue shimmer. Exactly. Yes, it is. And it still is as a magical. <laughs> and last one for me. <clears throat> I'm trying to move it closer. Wow. This will take ages to dry. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, my poutine gold is almost dry. Yeah, I think I will show them at the end because then they are probably dried. Oh my God, really? I, I have them in all around my table. I Me too. A mess. We have to work on a small space. Tiny fingers um, on a tiny plate. Need bigger table. <laughs> <laughs> need an assistant. Assistant is taking care of the doggy. Yeah, which is also important. How is yes. Rufus? Uh, he's doing well. He's very yes. excited today. I think it's because the weather is nice. It's not so cold. And he wants to be outside playing all the time. So it's keeping Miguel very entertained. <laughs> Rufus, that is not my dog's name. My my dog's name is Neo. But Martina decided to call him Rufus. So this is Neo Rufus. <laughs> okay. My last color is Beaver Tail Brown, which is an amazing brown with green shimmer. Like really, green shimmer. Crazy. So said I bought 1,000 US dollars worth in November, no extra cost for import or duties. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I will be swatching Hockey Puck Black, and this became one of my favorites today because it it's not a pure black, it's, it's a greenish black, I would say, and it has an incredible amount of rainbow in it, and um, Nunu said before that she thinks it looks like a rainbow in the night, and yes. I couldn't agree more. It does. But isn't it incredible? You wouldn't believe that this is hidden in here. Like, yeah, you will never say that. No, never. Okay, so. Na, na, na. So for you guys, those who know me know that I have my color charts like um, A4 printed. Um, and I really love them because I can see all the colors together. But in the beginning of the year, I made my new swatch like tags, um, like half of this size. And I discovered that some colors are not what I thought. They are much more amazing because uh, the more space the color has to flow and run, Mm. Mm, the more gorgeous they look. So make yourself a favor, or do just do yourself. So do yourselves a favor. Oh my God, my English is crap today. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, and do some big swatches because it's really worth it. Absolutely. Like I'm gonna show you something, okay? Just for you to see. I would have never said that this flat color would be so freaking amazing and I will love it so much. This is, by the way, Tiber Turquoise that is in the Beauty Skull Dropout, dropout set. Ah, that because just, you sprinkled them, yeah. Yeah, you know, like, yes, one mm. is like, woo, crazy. Yeah, yeah, you, you need to do it. Exactly, Terry, it's a huge project because she die cut them by hand and heat embossed each and every tag, which is yes. crazy. Well, I was watching TV at the same time. <laughs> and we it know you are crazy. So thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I cannot have this mess around me and work on anything. So I'm gonna dry a little bit all these beauties. 
I think I will late, I will show my pre-made tags because I have no chance to dry these huge pieces of paper in that short amount of time. But I think it's Come on, freaking that is a, amazing. It's, yeah, it's freaking, freaking, freaking amazing. We need, you all need that amazing black. So I'm going to show again the discount code. You can use any of those. Um, you really need this color. I'm also starting to get rid of the papers on my desk, which are starting to dry, but are still not dry. But again, a close up. I absolutely love them. Even the browns and the purples. Yes. Which is crazy because I actually don't like browns and purples and oranges. <laughs> <laughs> but this is very beautiful. You don't like oranges, but I have to say that the orange we create for the sifters is one of the most beautiful things we have ever yeah, made. Yeah, but that's because we created it. So we we had it in our hands to make it not too orangey, yellowish. Because I don't like, I like the peachy oranges, but not the yellow oranges. It's complicated. It's complicated. <laughs> <laughs> oh come on come on i'm burning myself but i don't care i'm just trying to get rid of all of my papers so louis uh no lord what is uh, what is the comment um uh, yeah what is the comment? Stop writing. Okay. Yes, that is that going hockey so fast. Black is crazy nice. <laughs> yeah, it is. Actually, I can show my pre-made swatches in the meantime while you are drying yours. Yes. I can show first the Northern Lights. I can take them out. Here it's painted and here it's sprinkled. Yeah, Moja, I like this purple. <laughs> it's surprising, but true. It's really nice. And then we have Oh, and it, it's the purple has, I hope you can see it, a golden shimmer. And as I said, blue and pink, sometimes even yellowish speckles in that rainbow effects. Then we have, where are you? Maple syrup bronze has also a golden shimmer. And for a brown, very nice and I think harmonic rainbow effects, which I really like. Then we have Emerald A, which is this amazing, fresh, springy green in the dissolved version and in the sprinkled version also a rainbowish color. I mean, we had surprisingly many rainbows within these sets. It's amazing. Then we are at Canadian Bacon Blush, which is one of my three favorites. I mean, come on. Isn't this a freaking amazing color? I mean, it's, it's blush, but it has Oranges and blues and pinks and I'm I'm a very pink person. I, I love all the pinks we have and I will say that my favorite forever and ever will be cosmopolitan pink, but this one is even better. Yeah. And and it's not a pure pink. It's like 
Yeah, blush. Skin tone. Beautiful, beautiful. And then my highlight. I mean, come on. <laughs> the black dissolved. It looks very green. Dark, deep green with a golden shimmer. And sprinkled. I hope you can see it well. This is crazy. It is. I think it's, it's really amazing. a rainbow in the night. Yes, it is. Okay, my swatches are dry. Uh, so, first is Bank Blue. So, this is one painted, you know, like very bold, luminous, amazing with this blue shimmer that is not so in your face, but still there. But when mm. you sprinkle it, oh, come on. Can you see that reflection? That is dry <laughs> and it's just the shimmer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I have no words for the, this blue. It's, it's totally amazing. And it's a blue uh, we missed. Yes, it is. I'm going to, you know, like the poutine gold, it goes now, but I'm going to leave it for the last one. Okay. Uh, the red, this. Uh, oh, Canada Crimson, such a bold red with this gold shimmer that makes it super special. It, I don't know. It reminds me of ancient uh, gemstones or something like that. But look when I sprinkle it. How crazy is that? I think it feels very oriental. Yes. And it has some black on it and some kind of pinkish, purplish. I don't know. You know, like, really, it's a rainbow, in, rainbow inside a red color that is not normal. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is beaver tail brown, beautiful brown with goldish shimmer. You can see that, uh, not goldish, sorry, greenish, greenish shimmer. You can see yeah, that? which makes it crazy. Yeah, it's so pretty. You look, <laughs> it looks super magical. And when you sprinkle it, it looks quite different. It it looks more orangey. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, it has also yellows and blacks and reds and it's very crazy color. Then everybody's favorite, which is the Looney Tooney Teal, which yeah. looks like this. I don't know. I don't know how to describe this color because it's not blue, it's not green, it's not teal, it's not turquoise, it's something else. With the purple shimmer, you can see that shimmer. Yeah, crazy. And when you sprinkle it, you have some yellows and some greens and so dark blues and this shimmer again. And now, as I hope you are sitting on your seats because this is crazy, amazing poutine gold. Look at this ancient gold we have here. Mm. This is with, you know, painted. Like freaking amazing. But when you sprinkle it, Oh my God, look at that. It has gold, it has green in yellow and orange and... It pools up so nicely. Yes, <laughs> I love this. I will yeah. paint my entire room with this. I will be a gypsy. I think this oh will be God. a lot of information. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. So let's create something, something. Have you seen my hands? Shut up. <laughs> I think all guys here and I think we are the winners today because your hands are messy too. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God. I need to clean my hands just a little because it's not going to disappear, of course, <laughs> but I, I will feel them like fresh and clean. <laughs> For those of you that know don't know me, I have a kind of OCD mm. and I need my table to be clean and I like my hands to be super clean too. She's so. a clean crafter. Yes, I'm a clean, clean crafter. Yeah, but clean, clean. actually my desk is also clean and not a mess. It's just I don't mind about the hands. I do. Yeah. 
<laughs> so, okay, this is important when you're going to work clean your space because uh, usually powders float and they settle everywhere and you don't know they are there until you put some wet product or water and then you have this in your <laughs> project, you know? Surprises. Yes, surprises, bad surprises. So I think last time we went live, I made a tag and the previous time I made a card. So today I'm going to make a journal page. I will stay boring and create ATCs because I had no idea. Tracy said, my mom is here watching and laughing about your hands. She's asking me <laughs> if I wear gloves with this magic. <laughs> Yeah, and and Sue said, yes, Nunu's cleanliness drives us crazy. Exactly. <laughs> Hila said, Nunu, your table cover camouflages your mess you think you <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so, <clears throat> okay, new page. What to do, what to do, have no idea. <gasps> so Valentine's is coming. Um, I will do some Valentine's thingy. I have these little girls, so cute. And I have also this one that has these arrows. And I thought it would be also cool, but I feel more like using this one. Fuck it, fuck it. Yes, this one. So I need a nice background. And I really want to use the colors we have shown today. But I'm not going to play red, okay? <laughs> Tina said, no, no, I'm the same. I want to have clean hands. I know, I know. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, yeah, clean hands. But the question is, does anybody actually wear gloves? I don't know how they can do it. I have seen some people doing it, but honestly, uh, no. I can't work like this. Me I neither. Need I really feel like using these two together. What do you think? The poutine gold and Canadian bacon blush. This could be very interesting. It will create some orange, but I actually don't care. I love it. I love it. Yeah, I mean, it has to be a nice orange because you, you like all the yes. base colors. Yes. Okay. So <clears throat> let's pick the pink. What is the pink? And I have no idea where I'm going. I just thought I would pick one of these sets. And Nunu is muted. I don't know why. Because I was coughing. Oh, this is no good. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I just decided I will have a look on these die cuts. So you probably see my process, how I decide on things. And I will just pick random things and then choose which magicals I can combine with the die cuts I'll be working with. Okay, I have this beautiful stencil from my friend Asia, Asia Market Lemon Creation. And to be honest, I think it will be very cool. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Let's I, do it. Ooh, you, you, I think. Uh oh. Well, I'm I... going to do not me. <laughs> I think I'm going hockey puck black, poutine gold, and beaver tail brown. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so I'm going to place this guy here with a little bit of washi tape, so it won't go anywhere. Which would be these three colors. Ooh, they should work well with these ephemera colors. Yeah. Gloves are just not possible, but hands have to be as clean as possible. Only so I don't leave fingerprints on my work. 
Yeah, I, I know that. But actually, washing your hair is super yes. helpful if you have stained hands. Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna add this with embossing powder because as I show you in we show you in the swatching, it's really cool technique and it will show the colors in a very cool way. So I'm going to add just embossing powder with uh, these brushes thingy all over the place. I have prepared some mixed media paper with a tiny bit of embossing and crackle paste. All right, good you did that in advance because that way the crackles. <laughs> yeah, there. hours and hours and hours. <laughs> <laughs> and I think I will start light with the poutine gold. I, I still can't imagine that food. It sounds uh, so weird to me. Yeah, I, and it looks not very nice. Honestly, it's like very weird. You see the fries and then you see the gravy. That is just the this, um, how you call it? How is that? Um, it's meat, actually. You know, like this liquid. So the, yeah, the gravy a little you bit eat with meat, thick. the sauce. Yeah, yeah, it's a sauce exactly. Mm -hmm. And then they put this goat cheese on top that is melting on top of that. And oh my gosh, that is delicious. Okay, I will always remember the first time we tried. It was in a food truck uh, near Banff, and it was. I love it. I just <laughs> love it. Somebody says poutine is very unhealthy, but yummy. Yeah, uh, you know, yeah, a lot of calories. <laughs> <laughs> because you have the fries and then you have the cheese and and yeah, they don't do a small dishes. It like is big. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna use uh, 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 uh -huh. Rosa's white. Rosa's white. No, okay, let's do the because it looks nice. The clearly clear. I am now adding some of the beaver tail brown, just to some places. Because I feel like it's just getting some darker tones into this poutine gold pools. And I think the, sh the shimmer could be interesting with the ephemera. Yeah, I, I know I, I know it's not healthy, but nothing is healthy if you eat it every day. My mom had, used to have a boyfriend and he was vegan and he was only eating not cooked things. Oh, and he's super sick now, uh, almost dead person, you know, like not not healthy at all. So nothing is good if you eat too much of that. That's true. Oh, oh. did we f for the for the persons here in the chat that are new to Lindy's and Magicals, we tend to say you should use them like you use spice in your dishes, L like the hot spices. Just start slowly, use a little. You can always add more, but you will have a hard time to take it off if you add way too much. And it gets too much very fast, I can tell you. Exactly. And also, when you spray water on top, don't spray a lot. Spray a little bit. See if you need more. Because if you add too much, you will have a colorful swimming pool. 
and you will need a long time to dry it or you will have to remove part of that with the kitchen paper and then you will absorb the color and all the magic and the shimmer and it's not cool. I that think, looks amazing, Martina. Yeah, but this is a good example. Like here you have a swimming pool where yeah. all the color is mixed and dissolved. But here you have these particles where you can see what it is or even better on this area here because it was just a mist of water. Yes. And so we as Martina prefer said, this. Add a little dry it. And if you want more, you can add more on top. It's going to work because it's going to activate the previous layer. I have this problem always when I'm teaching in person classes and the lady says, oh, mine doesn't look like yours. Yeah, because you are adding more and more and more and more powder. And that is not how you are going to get a super saturated color. If you want a saturated color, Add one layer, dry, and another layer on top. That's why we were so happy when we were able to come up with the sifters. Oh, yes. Okay, I have this. And I want to start playing with the colors. So, Canadian blush and putting gold. I'm super tempted of using, yeah, a little bit of this maple syrup will go good. So if we have the girl like this, let's think of how we are going to place the colors. We can do like this or like this. I mean, this is the perfect placement. Her mouth in the center of your circles. Mm, yes, he is like, mm. is it a he or a she? Is a she? Oh, she's she's. Mm. I'm not sure if I dare to add the black. I do, <laughs> <laughs> but I will dissolve it because I don't want to have these beautiful rainbows in here. And to create some kind of a watercolor. I'm just taking the magical jar, take a spoon or something and add a tiny amount of the powder into a palette and take some clean water. Sweet night person in group in the Facebook group said, Nunek, I love how you said maple syrup. I, <laughs> I, I'm a mess, you know, my English is a mess, but <laughs> thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you for coming, yes. And Tracy. Yeah, guys, don't work too much. I okay. don't uh, dare to add too much of the black. So I'll just sprinkle it in between. Okay, I'm using the maple syrup to get a transition between the pink and the gold. So I'm going a little bit on top of the pink with the powder. We will see now. Maybe it's a mess and I have to tear off the page. Yeah, I also have a, a nice or not so nice surprise. I don't know if you can see it. The um, green part of the black just dyed my white crackle paste. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now I have green speckles on the crackle paste. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> oh, okay. So water, not too much. I'm spraying from far, so I won't have a swimming pool. Wow. This is so grungy, but happy at the same time. <gasps> we are both extremely grungy today. Yes, 
<laughs> I didn't look on the screen for such a long time, but I mean, kind of similar choices. Well, yeah. On the screens. Okay, so I, I'm, I like it so much that I don't want to touch it, touchy. So I'm <laughs> gonna just move it a little bit to make the colors flow. Oh my gosh. And I'm gonna dry. I think I am at the same place as Nunu. And uh, so we'll stop adding things at yeah, the moment. Yeah, it, it's this moment that if we were alone at home, not in a live stream, we will let it dry as it is. Exactly. So it will look amazing. And this is true because I was stressing with my color swatching this morning and I had to heat emboss it and to take some of the liquid off with a towel and it looks really different if you have the time to just leave it in place and yes. wait until it's dried naturally. It's so much more beautiful. But I have to clean a clean dry now too. Which is boring to watch, I know. It's boring, yeah. So I, I want to show you something. I have here this amount of water that it will take forever to dry. And as I have a embossing powder, I will melt the embossing powder again. I don't want that. So I will take just this corner of my kitchen paper and absorb the water, touchingly, touching it very gently. So I don't pick a lot of the color or a lot of the shimmer. Yes, like so. The same here. Okay. Go go up again, camera. Cooperate. Oh, uh, merci, Sonia. Oh, tu fais aussi moi, je l'adore, je l'adore. So, you do that too, right? Well done. <laughs> Thanks, Aditi. She loves what she sees. Oh, thank you, Adi. So, I think they are now, well, damp they are not properly dry, dry but i think i can work on them and i absolutely love these different shimmers like the green shimmer and the gold shimmer how they Those come together look amazing now i just have to decide What's coming on top? <laughs> oh, that's... Oh. Okay. I have one matching butterfly. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Surprise. Hey, Benny. How are you? Hi. Okay, want it to be fully dry so I can stamp or something. Okay. It looks super grungy. Stamp is a nice thing to say. I want to make sure that my corners are dark. I'm using okay. a sponge tool and black ink. Okay, so I have my girl there. And I think I should use maybe this stamp to add some more circles here and there. Why not? 
but we need to think of a nice ink that is going to match this. So for that, I'm going to take my color chart. Color chart, color chart. Choo, choo, choo. Huh. Which color to use? What kind of ink? Oxide. Okay, I can use brushed corduroy and antique line then. And what about tea dye? It's too pinky, right? Okay. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I can try that. Hi, Olga. So good you're here. Hey, Olga, we missed you. How are you? I think that inking of the edges is one of the easiest and most effective techniques to make a project even more stand out. It takes nothing but looks amazing. Absolutely. Adding the drama. Frame it. <laughs> frame it, frame it like it's a piece of art. Yeah, it just adds drama, I think. Yes, we love drama. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think this one is clean. I will use this one. So, this is a circle stencils from Sneepart. Oh, uh, Jennifer Maguire recently used Lindis in mm. one of her recent videos. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, she did several times in the last, I think, last half year. Yeah. She had several videos with magicals. You see, these are trendy. You need them. <laughs> <laughs> I need to dry more. I will mute my mic. Okay. I don't think we can hear the mic, the, the dryer anyway, but... Uh, okay. okay, then so... I will unmute it. Okay. Okay, so let's add antiquated linen. Choo, choo, choo. I'm not going to add the wall stencil, just some circles here and there. And I'm going to be mixing all the three colors a little bit. Let me see how ooh, it looks nice. It looks nice. What I like about this is that I can layer the colors and I can go back and place the lightest one on top and it will show. I really like that. You were right, t dye goes so well. Good. I I think I'll add some more drama <laughs> and add some black stamping. Just you are very dramatic today, yeah? Oh yes. Behave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but but I mean I don't know why I usually step out of my comfort zone in these lives, which is actually a crazy idea. Mm, I think it's because you are a crazy person. Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think this tiny amount of more drama is what I needed on these things. It's not very visible, but it's just... Yeah, it adds to the layers and to the depth of the project. So, um, look what I do. I'm picking parts of the stencils where I feel the bubbles are escaping from the center. So I will create that effect around the circles. Buenos dias, saludos desde Peru. Buenos dias, buenos dias. So you are intentionally shaping these bubbles on the stencil into the direction you need them. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Okay, so a little bit more here. 
like so and we will go with the lightest color anticlining and you know i don't go and do circles so it's gonna look super saturated i go like this up so it will fade when the circle yeah. is finishing so so far this looks great we have this and i think these the, the poutine gold and the bacon blush they go so well together they do they do and i think there is no orange actually no no not too much because uh the my maple syrup they just blend yes it looks good I said no more magicals, I have enough. Now I will be checking all the websites in France to see who has those two sets. Um, I think it will take a little bit because they are on the website, Lindy's website, only from the 1st of February. I don't think any of the stores or distributors uh, got to get them yet. I think they don't have them by now, but they will. Yeah. Also, the store I work with, uh, they ship to France. If you don't find them, I'm pretty sure we will have them next week or so. <laughs> Message me, Isa. Okay, so <laughs> I will place the girl here. And I feel like adding some hurts. What do you think? Yes. Oh, yeah, why not? Because Valentine's yes. Day. So, yes, it's a Valentine thing. So, I'm going to take a piece of watercolor paper, 200 grams, and I'm going to cut it because it's too big. And I will cut all the hairs by hand. Those colors are absolutely fabulous. I love them in squids and loving them now in magical, so vibrant. Yes, they are stunning. Absolutely. So I have some little stamps here. I feel like this could be good. Why not? Yes. Did it, did it. I should take them a little bit down. So sorry. Oh my God, you are almost done. Come on. <laughs> no, I have no idea where I'm going. Okay. So as I'm not good with the stamping and I really want this to be crisp, I place it down. And I'm going with my fingers all over the stamp. So I will have maybe not perfect, but close a stamping. Somebody on Facebook is very excited and thinks it's so wonderful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I think yeah. with the time we will get to know everybody. When you give permission uh, yeah, I hope for this so. thing. Yeah. I don't know how many hertz I will need, if I will fail or what. So I'm going to use also this other stamp. Yeah, I hope so, Terry. She said, that's when the best things happen, when you don't know where. Who is it? I that? hope there's something good to happen. This is probably not the best idea. And somebody invented blocks for that. So I better <laughs> use it. Yeah, but I mean, even with the stamping block, I managed to mess up stamping. I'm just not a not not an appropriate crafter, you know. I mess up. I mess up too. And I don't care actually. Yeah, exactly. 
I need more black thingies. Hmm, some splatters? No, no, no. He, like here, one of these. Oh, okay. Okay. Hola, Chris. Hola, Chris. Okay. So, with this. And I'm gonna use black embossing powder with this because, yeah, I'm very much into embossing powder lately. <laughs> I can understand. Right? Okay, so I have this. And I feel like adding black, honestly. Like, whew. where is my black? Yes, this, no, this is not a black one. Well, I'm still black. looking for something black. Uh, where is my boogie down black? Boogie down black. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, what should I do if I... Uh, no, 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 no. Maybe I have to do some die cuts in black or something like that because I think I don't have anything black anymore yeah I could use some foliage in black I think mm, that will look super cool goodbye goodbye okay bye <laughs> just going to use the physics thingy I guess well, I have it on my desk. I just need some die cuts. Okay. Honestly, I don't know if I will be using this one because everything here is super big. Vale, Isa, escríbeme luego y te digo. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Ok, tenemos eso. Y tenemos esto. Ok, gracias. Estamos felices de ir con ti a la kitchen. So, mm -hmm. I want to use the pink. Okay, I should have uh, hurt dyes somewhere, but I don't know where. So, I'm, I think I'm gonna. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 I don't know. Maybe. I'm, back. I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use this. Um, where? Wait. I think I can find my my dice too. So I'm gonna put Martina on screen while I go <laughs> and look for my dice. I am just pulling my die cuts off of my paper. I've been using one of my all-time favorites. It just has such beautiful foliage parts. And I've been using a very thick black paper which I think will work perfectly with my 
tax somehow like yes i think that works my desk is very messy but i think it works <laughs> it usually happens to me if i die cut black paper i end up with a totally messed up desk because these tiny hairs of the die cutting are everywhere Um, Why can I not find it when I need it? You could probably use something different. No, I Did... want her. And I have a very beautiful Renke guy. Yeah, very but you probably one. have you probably have 17 parts. No, I only <laughs> own one. <laughs> and I cannot find it because it's super tiny. I ah! am very sorry. Where is it? Where is it? With the please, Master Star. <laughs> but this is really a pity. I'm at the moment. I am in a huge rearrangement and perching process of my craft room. Like Ooh. half of my shelves are empty, and half of the stuff is on the floor. Like I am also not able to find anything. I totally get it. And I mean, your craft room is so organized. Holy Wagman, I can find it. <laughs> I think I will go and get my stapler because I feel like things like this need to be stapled. And probably I could try to add, yeah, black thread yeah hold me holy batman yeah holy batman <laughs> are you still over there i'm still searching i need to find it, it will freak me swimming out in dice <laughs> this is what happens to poor people with ocd you need a bigger room I need an assistant. <laughs> you could hire your Rufus. No, really, I don't. I don't find it. Where is? Oh, but I found something that I was Let looking it go. for two weeks ago. Very nice. Let it go. This is impossible. Yeah. Otherwise, just let it go. Otherwise, you'll drive crazy. I know. Yes. <laughs> Okay, I will let it go, let it go, let it go. Here we are. Let it go, the shit, la la la. Musical episode. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I couldn't find it. But I saw a very nice stencil and I found a, um, a frame that I was looking for two weeks ago. <laughs> so... Let's draw some hurts by hand, messy hurts, and then we will fussy cut it. Fussy you fussy. can do it. I can do it. Yes. Oh my god, I'm the worst. No. Drawing hurts. It, that is awful. I cannot do it. Ah. I could send you a heart. <laughs> oh, I know. I just don't know why I've done. I didn't think about this before. Because we both were again Crazy. not very prepared, as usual. Don't say that. It it seems very unprofessional. <laughs> no, no, we are spontaneous and we are going with the flow. <sighs> I don't like this. Okay, so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to use this beautiful stencil to draw some perfect hearts. I still don't like that. Now, uh, Isa, so you are also in the middle of a reorganization process. I think it's so exhausting. I mean, it's, it's also good to let go of all the things you don't need. 
but it's also very, very exhausting. It is. Okay. Bye, Sonia. Bye, Sonia. Thanks for coming. Merci pour venir. Merci, merci. Okay, so I just cut my paper and fold it into so I will have more or less uh, how did you say that? Beautiful what? heads. It's not bad. It's not bad. Okay, I like it. I like it like it. Hmm. <laughs> Why do I now have to think of these lemurs in Madagascar? I like to move it, move uh -huh. it. I like to move it, move it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's because you said you like it. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> First no, no. ATC almost done i think almost. oh my god she is almost done and i'm here in the middle of something she will go have dinner buy an ice cream i will still be here yeah but that's because your dinner is probably 15 hours after mine so oh. <laughs> <laughs> for those who don't know nuno is in spain i am in switzerland and I mean, for me, it's it's normal to have dinner at 6 p.m. And and usually, usually you are laughing. Uh, that, because that is ridiculous. In a exactly. <laughs> <laughs> at 6 p.m. we are giving kids a snack in the middle of the, you know, homework or playtime. Okay, I don't know how many of these I will be using, so I'm going to cut a bunch of them. Focus, focus, it's time to focus. I don't want to mess this up. I like this one because it has a lot of back. But I can cut some more. And use this part. La, 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 la. Oh my god, my hands are so freaking dirty. You will survive. I, I guess I will survive. Yeah, hopefully. So I think there is a big discussion <laughs> about reorganization and who has to take care of what. Okay. <laughs> Because when you were looking for your heart, I've been talking about my big process here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and I mean, the, the, the pity it, for it me. It seemed that she was moving somewhere, you know, like with boxes around and things and crazy. Me? Yes. Yeah, it looks like I am moving, but I am actually not. I just decided to... To let go. Let it go. Let mm -hmm. it go. Okay, I have five. We need one more at least because five, no, six is not a good num number. Thank you, Isa. Number two almost. Oh my Don't God, Isa not... speaks so many languages. How many? At least English and I guess that was German and yes. Spanish. 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 But but you talk many languages too. Just two. Uh, I mean one and bad English. <laughs> <laughs> I had an interview yesterday with a very nice uh, British lady and I was scared I, I will not you know pick everything. Because usually with British people, it's hard. They Their pronunciation is so cool and so good. And sometimes I get lost and then my brain disconnects. But I could understand 
almost everything. <laughs> and cool. It was nice. I I actually I noticed that I started to listen some British podcasts. And I mean, usually I, I watch my series in, in English, which is not very helpful with my progress in Swedish, but <laughs> it helps with the confidence in English. So. Bye, Vina. Bye, Vina. Thank you for coming. Oh, Olga just said that nice lady is watching. Yes, I know. Great. Okay. Okay. So we have some hurts. Nothing breaks like the heart. Yeah. This is a musical <laughs> episode. Nothing hurts like the heart. <laughs> no, nothing breaks like. No, yeah, breaks, hurts. I don't know. Whatever, both, Miley. Both. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna color these in pinks. Okay, I think they will look nice, but I need something else than Canadian blush. So let's take a look at the hula hop and pick something that oh, now will you match. Go with the what did we talk about? Bodacious blush. Bodacious blush. I was just thinking that bodacious blush will look nice, but also these beautiful Andreas Azaleas. Yes, Andrea. Andrea is winning. Andrea! I hate, I love hate this color because it never looks like I want. <laughs> <laughs> I can go and yell at you in Polish to add to that family. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Donna said, I have no magicals, but I'm not sure I will be able to pass those. Donna, you need to try them. They are really a lot of fun. You you won't regret yeah. they They are so easy to use. And I mean, we don't know what kind of projects you do, or I don't, but they are so versatile. You can do heavy mixed media projects. You can you can do some mix some medium things like we do today, but you can also do very proper card making things if you just use the magicals to color paper and then die cut or um, color your pastes or use the um, the magicals to sprinkle. You can use them as watercolors. We have seen many many artists doing that. Oh, Isa said she's French. And she is speaking English and studied Spanish, German, Italian, and even a tad of Japanese. Wow. And she's this studying your crazy now. Yeah. Are you a philologist? Or is it just a passion, a passion about languages? I love to know these kind of things about you guys. So I'm just sprinkling a little bit of these Andreas Azaleas in some of the hearts. Now I'm going with the Canadian blush in some of them. In some of the hearts, I add more of the powder. In some, I do less. Yeah. Ooh, how pretty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I like it when you get excited. Thank you. <laughs> and I'm going to add a little bit of the putting gold because why not? Just very tiny bit, okay? Because it's super tiny surface. Okay, water. I'm adding quite a lot of water because you know, it's tiny piece of paper and I want the color to flow and, everywhere. And this really makes a difference if you color the die cuts after you have cut them. It yes. makes them look so different than when you die cut them from a bigger surface. It has a totally different look. 
Oh, Donna said couldn't afford them at the time, but my turn is coming. Oh, that's great. And I didn't really understand them. We have many, many uh, videos about how to use them. Uh, we have a big team. You could join the Facebook group. Um, we have a color challenge every month and we pick random winners. Like you don't have to do a super project with them to win. Uh, we have many videos in the channel and we are always there if you have questions. Just go post them in the group and some of somebody from the team will reply. Exactly. And, and really don't hesitate to, to ask because the more questions we get, the more specific we can answer. I and don't be think... shy. Sorry, don't be shy because maybe that doubt, that question you have, somebody else have it. Yeah, exactly. Oh, no crafting for Isa. Oh. oh, no. Maybe you have to take screenshots then so you can recreate it. Raquel, that is mixed media arte. Mixed, mixed media arte. She said that she speaks Spanish, Catalan, and a bit of English. Can the magicals be used with resin? I have no experience. I have to say that I so uh, I watched a reel yesterday on Prima account using something in the mold. I think it was Finnebar Micas, and I thought like I had to do that with the magicals. Ah, oh, the flower, and the flower. Yes, I want to try that. Yeah, but that would mean that the glitzies should work. But I have yes. no idea if it does work. Because the the, the, the actual magicals are water reactive. Yeah, but they don't react as much with the... Um, how is that called? With the resin. Because yeah, the so resin the... doesn't have water. Exactly, that's why I think it would be the mica that could yes. have an effect yes. on, yeah. Look, Pamela said, um, what? they are not difficult, I think she's talking about the magicals, to use at all, very forgiving. Gorgeous results, you won't be sorry, try once, you'll be hooked. Absolutely. Exactly. You are, and you are done, Martina? What? You are done? No, I am just reading and thinking and talking. <laughs> I, well, I am halfway there, I think. Come on, you need to see this. Because they are absolutely gorgeous and amazing. They absolutely are. Yes. So I'm going to quickly uh, ink the edges. And I think it's good that you didn't find a dye. So they are all like different. Slightly and grungy. wonky yes. and handmade. Yes. But it was a funny moment. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> it works, but they don't react the same with water. They give a strange color results. Micas work yeah. better. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm not expecting them to dye completely the resin. It's not what I want. Uh, I want them to be like right in the top of the piece, like on the bottom of the mold. So they will create a cool layer. I had to experiment that. If it works, I will show you the next day. Oh, oh, I think wow. these ATCs will give some life advice. Mm. <laughs> oh, yes. Practice kindness, be authentic, live in the moment. Okay. Words of wisdom. Um, thanks, Tim. <laughs> 
And as I don't like the white edges on these stickers, I usually glue them onto a piece of cardstock, which makes them also sturdier. And cut it out again. Mm -hmm. And then you ink or you color the edges with the exactly. marker? Exactly. Or, or do the same with the, with the inking tool which I used for the um, edges of the ATCs. Okay, so I'm gonna pick a couple of quick things. I'm not sure if they are going to be visible, but I don't feel happy if I don't do this on every page. So let's create <laughs> some white colors, white circles. Your signature circles. Yes, I can live without them. Yeah, almost invisible, but I know they are there and that makes me happy. I mean, at the end of the day, it's about this. Happiness. Yes. This should make you happy and nothing else. And nothing else matters. <gasps> I heard <laughs> that, I think, I think yesterday. And I didn't hear it in such a long time. Oh, really? Yeah. I listen to that song at least once a week. And now I'm completely obsessed with Miley Cyrus' uh, version with Metallica. I I haven't heard that because I don't listen a lot of radio. But I loved the Apocalyptica version. Mm, I haven't heard that one. I need to find it. Just instrumental. Oh, okay. Oh, cool. Okay, this is going to need black splatters. I can feel it. <laughs> so I'm going to pick my almost dead inky. It's an old reel. You have to scroll down and find it. Oh my god, I, I'm lost. I'm so sorry. I, I was not watching the screen and I couldn't read it. So I'm, <laughs> I'm inking with my almost dead ink because I don't want hard stamp okay I, I think aditya has been talking about her um i remember them when she used uh, magicals and resin she she showed that in a reel okay but i think it was some time ago okay then tomorrow you give me the link okay <laughs> hi Juani. <laughs> Oh, it's the son of my wedding. Really? Oh, how wow. Cool. That's so freaking cool. Wow. Amazing. That little stamping is enough to have this grungy, grungy thingy. What? Grungy, grungy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like grungy, Tracy grungy. is not the only one onomatopoeic in this family. Oh, there's someone on Facebook saying hello. Hello, Facebook user. Hello. Okay. So I'm inking the edges of my girl. Yes, uh, Aditi, we... I remember, I actually remember watching your reel, but I haven't, I surely haven't seen the version on YouTube. Okay, so. Huh. The first one I think is perfect. Dreamer of dreams. Why not? I'm gonna remove part of this so it's not going to be super thick. Yeah. Oh like no that. no. Yes. I have just seen that um somebody asked um Aditi for her Instagram handle. And I think it could be a nice idea to share our handles too, because I'm not sure if everybody has our Instagram handles. Um, so I can do this. Actually, we did this last time and I forgot today. Frau Pony. That's me. <laughs> and. Nuneka with two other lines, uh, how the hell that is called. <laughs> yeah, it, it's easier underscore, with you. Underscore. Yeah. 
Okay, so I have Dreamer of Dreams. I need something a little bit to start the under my girl. So Martinez is going to wait for me forever. 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 So I usually use the packaging for these things because I don't want to add a lot of dimension, otherwise it's not going to fit. But come on, Nunu, what is wrong with you? Nothing. <laughs> okay, so we have Ooh, don't run, don't run. Thanks, Aditi. I'm we just having have... a hard time to figure out where to place my thingies. Thingies. We have a saying in Spain. We have dress me slowly. I'm in a rush. Which means that if you are in a rush and you try to do things quickly, you will screw it up. They get um, worse. Yes, yeah. exactly. And it, you will need more time. So <laughs> you better calm down and do it. Yes, take your time. You I'm know. not in a rush. No, no, I'm talking about myself. Yeah, but, but don't, feel, don't feel that you have to hurry. You don't. You don't have to hurry. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, we are, I think we are three lives away from a <laughs> musical <know>. episode. <laughs> oh, finally. Yeah. Finally. Finally, finally. Okay. Now you just need to figure out how to place all these freaking hearts. I will now think of sequence. Ooh. Love, love sequins. <laughs> and I mean, I had these beautiful batches, but um, nope. We are done here. We don't need them. Oh, by the way, the side effect of my cleaning process of my craft room is that I have a ton of stuff to get rid of, which I still have to figure out how to get rid of. <laughs> and I have a ton of new needs, which is a pity. <laughs> I always say this. You need empty space to make room for new stuff. Yeah, the exactly. consequences of cleaning. And I already know what I need. What do you need? Surprise me. Well... Actually, there is a lot of Tim Holt stuff coming out lately, which I really love. Okay. <clears throat> so, we're going to need a couple of foam squares for the girl. Oh, thank you, Raquel. Let me see. Sequins? Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> I love when she talks with herself. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, we are having so much fun today. Um, Isa asks, that new lost shadow color, Martina? Yes, that. And actually... Um, I think I've seen some die cuts and embossing folders, which I think are very interesting. It's just I, I didn't get new stuff in such a long time, like like out of the box new stuff. And I just feel like I want to explore and try new things and probably do more messy stuff like today because I just missed this on the nice, clean and tidy side of crafting. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, does this I make know, sense? Yeah. It does. It does. Good. Oh no, you ripped her off. Yes, because it's too much, too much dimension. Too much. I was Is there a of... thing as too much dimension? Crazy. Because this is a book and I need to be able to close it. No, I, I love this. I mean I loved when, when Aditi shared her Frenchy album oh my god I mean, yes this is huge but i absolutely love when when these books 
come out as bulky as they are. Yes, I agree. Okay, so dreamer of dreams, you will be there. I'm just going to place a little bit of this here. <gasps> I have another idea, Nunu. Okay, well, when, when we are done with our musical episode, yes. we could do one in rhymes. One what? Rhymes. Oh, okay. Oh my God, that is hard. <laughs> I had a lot of fun with my friends doing that. They, you know, I, I came to the chat one day and they were all rhyming and I was like, what the heck are you doing, crazy people? And it was so much fun, all, all of them replying like that. Oh my gosh, crazy girls. Okay, so I'm just adding one of these here. So it will lift it like that. You see that? So I can place the bye, Kelly. Hi, bye Thanks bye. Thanks for joining. Yeah, Moita, you remember, right? And Aditi remembers too. Yes, yes. Come on. All these crazy people drives me crazy. People. People. Okay, I have this big one. I'm gonna place two of these. Actually, it's so good that I cut them myself because as I fold the paper, they are like naturally lifting. Dimensional. So, yes, yeah, so cool, so cool. Let me see. I am now using my tiny card making tools on my mixed media ATCs. <sighs> Isn't that amazing? It, it is, it is. <laughs> we love you both. <laughs> I'm very late, have done so much beauty. Oh, no worries, you can always rewatch it. We don't delete it. <laughs> <laughs> no, that would be such a shame. Absolutely. After all this effort. I mean, usually after a live, my adrenaline is on 275 and I need yeah. about five hours to get down. That's why and we don't do Sunday evenings to the get together yeah, because, because I have to work. Sleep. Yes, yes, yes. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we could one, two, three, four, five. So we can pick two more, like maybe these two guys and place them like here. Absolutely, yes. Um, I think if you would like to run, you will go running now after the live stream. Uh, no, because I'm exhausted and on adrenaline. <laughs> and it's way, way, way past my dinner time. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I think I will skip dinner today. Really? Yeah. It's too late mm. to eat. It's too late, to, too late. To. I will keep these two guys for another moment because they are super pretty. I don't want to throw them away. Oh my gosh, I have such a mess in my table. Okay, so I'm just gonna add some black splatters. I'm very tempted of adding some black something. Black somethings. Yeah, yeah, I'm actually also adding black somethings. Yeah, I wanna copy you. <laughs> what are my black, black, black somethings in here? No, I'm actually not starving. I think I, I have enough in storage <laughs> for some days. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> I should have black ones. Like purpurina? Really? No, sequins. Sequins? Okay, here they are. Blacky blackies. There are blacky ones here. No, purple. Mm, but actually, these are much better than blackies. Just get in there. You go to your place right now. <laughs> Something happened here. It all came. I think okay. it's not I my day today, yeah? Won't be adding anything anymore. Anything anymore. 
Anymore, anymore. anymore. <laughs> black splatters and I'll be done. Okay. Where are my black? Split splat. Please splat splat. My tags are still wet. I hope you can no, see no that way. on the back side. Yes, no they are. Way. Yeah. I'm so happy I only use one brush today. This is the second, so I don't have to clean a lot today. <laughs> yeah, true. I have a painter's knife, two brushes, and the stencil. That's it. Okay, so covering the photo with my fingers. I can dry my thingies from the beginning in the meantime. Yes. I mean, dry, come dry. on. Come on, come on. This is crazy. Oh, this is crazy. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we don't go there. Okay. Black, 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 black. Oh my God, yeah. Black splatters are a thing. This is absolutely crazy green, Olga. I agree. Yeah, it, it hurts my eyes. I know all guys with me in that. Okay. We can... Oh, no, no. Yes. We need to do something. Oh my God, yes, yes, yes. So. Mm. We have a question for you. Uh, for the chance to win a $25 voucher for Lindy's store. Okay? So, my question, I have it written somewhere in a piece of paper. Yes. I used, we used to use this intro. I'm going to play it, okay? Because it's super short. I'm going to play this intro. What is the intro? Here. Of that one is this one. Okay, but today we use one that Olga had been prepared for us. So that was a long one. Can you tell us the difference in minute and second between one and the other one? I start guessing. <laughs> I think they, they, they are in shock. Yeah, it looks like. Bye, Isa. Two, three seconds? No, no, it's, okay, 25 seconds. Keep guessing because it's more than 25 seconds. Much more, much more. This is going to be a lot of fun. 66 seconds. Hmm. How many seconds? <laughs> okay. Keep guessing, keep guessing. I can say it's less than two minutes. Five seconds, five and five seconds. Oh my God, this is going to take them forever. <laughs> um, okay, so I can say that the new intro is less than two minutes okay and from that you have to take off the eight seconds of the old one so it's less than two minutes and you take off eight seconds 78 is close <laughs> 98 is close Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think you have never been guessing so long. Still not, still not. 
I can't. No. But it's the first time we can okay, follow okay. the comments. Okay, I have it. I have it. But okay, it's eighty-two seconds, and I have a Facebook Facebook user that said eighty-two seconds. So please tell us your name because we cannot see it. Is eighty-two seconds. So you see here. Um, the new one is one minute and 30 seconds. The old one is eight seconds. So it's one minute 22. That is 82 seconds. So please, please, please tell us your number. Yes, uh, right. I am my name and I said 28 seconds. <laughs> Pretty please. So I think can... Lynn Webb. Lynn Webb. Okay, Lynn. So please message me or message Martina on Messenger and we will tell you what to do to get your price. <laughs> I cannot do math. <laughs> um, okay, Martina, do you want to give away another voucher? Oh, wait a second. Sue okay. said that Juana also said 82 okay. seconds. Okay. I didn't see Juana's comment, so we have two winners already. One for Juana and one for Lynn. Is that fair? Do you guys think that is okay? Actually, she's right. Juana was before her. Oh, so okay. I think we should we should give them both a voucher. Okay. Okay. So So Juana I just contact me. Message me. me. Yeah. Yeah. And Lynn, you message us and we will tell you what to do, okay? Tina did said 82. Yeah, it's not who said 82, it's who said that first. Oh my God, I feel so bad always when we do giveaways. Yeah, me too. I'm just trying to go back and have a look. And you guys need to understand that it doesn't show in the same uh, order that you see it because we use a platform to go live and it will show with a little bit of delay for you compared to so us. The first I see is Juana. Okay, I miss Juana then. Then after that, I see Facebook user, which we now that is know Lynn. is Lynn. Yes. And then we, we, we ended it and we said we have it. Yes. Okay, so we so will I think give it's two these vouchers. Two, because, because I see, I mean, I see Tina Ortiz writing 82, but I think this was after we said the number and we said stop. As soon as I saw the Facebook user that is Lynn, I yeah. said, okay, we have it. Yeah, and so that, that comment was why I after say... Lynn wrote her oh, name. Oh, Tina said, no problem. Maybe next time, sweetie. We always do this. So you come and watch. Okay, I finished my page. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, Martina, do you want to show us your ABCs close up? I can do. I just have to get rid of my... Hit it tool. Hit it. So I have been using Poutine Gold, mm -hmm. Beaver Tail Brown, and Hockey Puck Black. Okay. And there is some crackle paste in the background, some embossing and black stamping. And then just some riped ephemera stickers, die cut and some sequins. Um, they are gorgeous. I love them. I You do this so well. Come on. Hila, I will answer in a second. They are amazing, Martina. So I will Thank show you. you now my page, grungy page. I hope you can see all this shimmer 
Oh, look at yes, that. Look at can. that shiver. <laughs> Ooh, ah, la, la, la. Yes. So I've been using Canadian bacon blush, poutine gold, maple syrup bronze, a little bit of Andrea's azaleas. This is from Alexandra's artist set. And I also use Clearly Clear embossing powder and Boogie Down Black. It's impossible to see the name, but here it is. Boogie Down Black. Okay, so uh, Hila was asking, what are the names of the Grey Magicals? There is Pocket Watch and what's the other one? It's It was sold out and I can't find it on the website. That comes individually, I think only the Manta Ray Grey, that is one of the sifters, but it's exactly. sold out. It's sold out. And we don't know if we will have it again because we run out of jars. So probably Yeah, but no. we, we are like... But look at the range. Fingers. Yes, look at the range of greys and blacks we have wait wait <laughs> because they are truly amazing all of them and they are all rainbowish as you can see rainbow not the poker watcher is the only one that is not rainbow but this is rainbowish which one is this one uh silent night silver that is in the jingle bells look at that yeah, and I mean, if you have some of the shakers, the stormy this sky, stormy sky. Oh my gosh, absolutely one of my favorite colors ever. Okay, so I uh, do not have more questions. Thank you, guys. I think we are done for today. Uh, yeah. guys, uh, I have full set. Syndrome and it's driving me crazy <laughs> that I don't have it. Uh, we will work on that. We will work on that. Like yeah. you really like the sifters so much that the boss is really trying to find new yards to get more done. In that case, I cannot say it hundred percent, but I I feel like we will have them back. I mean, we know she is working very hard on. On getting making them things back, work. Yes. yes. And just once again, like, please, whenever you create something, share it on the Facebook group, share, share it on the socials, tag us. Um, yes, we want your, to see it. We love to see it. Your questions. We, we like to hear and read your questions because this is really helpful for us to know what we can help you with. Yeah, and if you are not following Lindy's gang um, on Instagram, you should start doing it because we have to tell them, Martina, very soon uh, we will be doing live streams there too. <laughs> <laughs> Don't spill the beans. Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, thank you so much. Um, I will share, we will share with you all a beautiful outro that Olga has created. Thank you so much, Olga. Thank you, Martina. Thanks, I have had a lot of fun today. I also had a lot of fun. And thanks, everyone, for being with us. I enjoyed yeah, every second. Thank you, everybody.